guys so here I have another haul to share with you of course Black Friday edition quick disclaimer I am going to ramble my butt off like seriously if you don't want to hear it I suggest you click out and go to sleep like it's my video and I can ramble if I want to see I've already started so with all that being said I hope you all had a fun and safe Thanksgiving I hope you were able to spend quality time with friends and family eat great food and had an even better Black Friday experience. Like it was so much fun. Like it was chaos, it was madness, and guess what? I loved every single minute of it. Like it was just so much fun. Like possibly the best Black Friday I've ever had. It was just, oh God, so fun. So to start out, I'll talk about Thanksgiving and then move forward. I had the best plan ever. Like my plan led me through Black Friday with just ease little bit tired, a little bit exhausted, but with all that being said, it was still pretty fun and went in my plan. So Black Friday, um, I totally just went to every single store I could and it really helps to make friends with people because you get in there and you talk to people. It's like, look, do you think you can hold this? And do you think you can save this? I want to get that, but I kind of want to wait. I ended up calling like a ton of stores and like you know pricing everything. Black Friday for me is usually for the electronics because I can get clothes and Bath and Body, all that stuff I can get at any time with the coupon or on sale. So, but the Black Friday deals for electronics are just like the best. So believe it or not, the best deal was in Sears. You know I'm thinking electronics are going to be better in like Best Buy, even Walmart or you know stuff like that. But Sears ended up saving me about oh maybe 40 percent so i just i really struck out it was just great okay so thanksgiving my parents came over super early around i'll say maybe six o'clock in the morning and my dad's like chef supreme so he cooked up until like one we had a few friends and family come over and the plan was for them to leave around five so my parents and i could clean up and then go to bed around seven it didn't work out that way. They wanted to stay and laugh and talk and all that great stuff. So it's like, okay, cool. But it's like, look, we need to go to bed because I want to make it for Black Friday. I want to be there early and just do what I need to do. And they just kept talking and going on and on. So it's like, look, you guys don't got to go home, but you got to get the heck out of here. <laughs> so the plan changed. I'm like, Dad, you stay up and like hang out with them and, you know, and mom and I are going to go to bed, and then when we wake up around 11, you can go to sleep. So it just really worked out. So that was pretty cool. The company left, I guess, while we were sleeping. But my mom and I woke up, and then we just headed straight downtown. San Francisco Shopping Center, crazy madness. People were out. It was just so much fun. It was not really chaotic in terms of, you know, like fighting or anything like that. Well, a couple little spurs here and there, but it was pretty much a great experience. Like, we went in the mall first and just did Old Navy first because Old Navy, I have a little cousin, little, he's like seven or so, and he's just obsessed with Wii. And I'm like, okay, in Old Navy, they have like $15 jeans, they have like $5, those fleeces, just a bunch of stuff. And if you spend 40 bucks, you can get a free, um, I believe Mario Brothers, you or something like something. I forget what it was. It's wrapped up upstairs, but you know, something like that. So you can get a Wii a game. And um, they also gave a, you spend 50 bucks, you get $10 off. So we just did it, you know, that was great. And Sears opened up a little bit later. So we went to Sears and that's in a different city. So we did that. And then we kind of went like back and forth, but it just worked out. And then, well, I guess the main squeeze for me and you guys is Bath and Body Works. So I ended up going to two. The first store I went to didn't have the wallflowers I wanted. All of them. So I had to go to another store that still had pretty good stock. So that was good. Um, if you think about it, Black Friday, I mean, two for 20, great. Um, what else? They had the White Barn Christmas Candle, 10 bucks. Not thrilled, but it's okay. 
and they had the wallflower packs for like five bucks buy three get three free aromatherapy buy two get one free seal bigelow and same with true blue spa so the deals were pretty standard but the stacking of coupons really saved and you guys are just going to kill me once you see it i'm going to show the receipts near the end so stay tuned for those and yeah i did some um online ordering which will be in part two of my black Friday Madness that's coming I guess this week. Did a test store order, did an outlet order. So I pretty much just ran through BBW like a champ. It's crazy. All right so let me show you what I got and take it from there. So first we have three wicks of course lavender vanilla favorite, cranberry pear bellini favorite, fresh bamboo favorite, Peach Bellini, love it. Um, Fresh Balsam, love it. Winter, love it. Glare, sorry. Spiced Apple Toddy. Frosted Cranberry, even though it's a dud, I wanted to try it one more time. White Barn, number one, Omega and Spice. Peppermint Mocha. Winter Candy Apple with New Wicks. And Twisted Peppermint, White Wax Edition. And then the wallflower. So we have lavender vanilla. I think I bought six of those. So one, two, three, four, five, six. Then we have island margarita, central amber, one, two. Oh, white barn Christmas 2012. I've burned a little bit of it, so yeah. Vanilla coconut, two of those, frosted cranberry, and a sealing cotton. And then I have body care, eucalyptus teeth, body wash and foam bath. Same with eucalyptus spearmint, the lotion, and then vanilla verbena body wash and bath foam, foam bath, sorry, and then body lotion. So that's pretty much everything I ended up getting <laughs> for Black Friday. Um, like I said, the deals are pretty cool. I didn't really need any candles, but I didn't want to go there and like just be a party pooper, not get anything. My mom got some stuff too. And between the two of us, we totally like nailed it. It was just a blast like probably the best BF I've ever been to so let's talk about this white barn Christmas 2012 it was 10 bucks and I mean it's nice but I only got one <laughs> and that definitely tells you a lot the description reads celebrate the season with comfort and joy a jubilant fragrance of sugared pine sweet green balsam crisp apple and what does that say? Oh, smoked firewood, sorry. Um, to me, it's just a mixture of bonfire maple wood and fresh balsam. It's pretty much a nice balance between the two. I didn't care for bonfire maple wood. I love fresh balsam, so for me, it's like 60, 40. Uh, it's, it's okay, it burns okay, it smells great. That review's coming up soon, so stay tuned for that one. The wallflowers, um, you know, like I, I don't like going in there and leaving empty-handed, so I just made the best of it and got a few of those. My lavender vanilla, I love that to the max. Island margarita, have to have it. Seattle and cotton. I tried this one back when I was experimenting with the wallflowers, and I didn't get a throw from it. So I think now they've kind of worked out the little problems and think I'll, I won't be able to enjoy it this time around. It's a great bathroom scent, so I love that. Frosted Cranberry, I didn't really enjoy it in candle form, but silly me and grabbed another one. <laughs> when will I ever learn? And then, that's pretty cool. The aromatherapy stuff was free. And, yeah, that's pretty much everything. I will do the prices, the breakdowns, and all that stuff. All the stuff, believe it or not, came out to about 60 bucks or less. Seriously, I just couponed it up and had a great time. So yeah, that's pretty much the end of my 
Black Friday haul part one. I do have more coming. Like I said, I did some online orders and outlet and just a whole bunch of stuff. So I'm going to do a collective of all that stuff sometime this week or even the beginning of the week after this week. Because <laughs> like I said, I don't know if it's going to come or not soon enough. So yeah, that's pretty much that. Um, the standouts for me are definitely Lavender Vanilla Cranberry Fresh Bamboo. Those are my favorites. Again, they've changed the wicks on Winter Cran Winter Cranberry. Winter Candy Apple. They're now the thin white wicks, which are dreaded, but they went from one, one extreme to the next. So hopefully you'll notice a difference. And the Sparkling Blackberry Woods is currently online for five bucks. I called my store and they don't have it. So I'm like, hmm, this was definitely a way for them to make more money and more money on shipping. But I'm going to circumvent that and ask them to just lump that with my other order because I just spent like maybe like 70 bucks online last night. And it's like, no, we need a solution. You should have released that lotion yesterday. That's just what I think, but they have their own rhyme or reason, so, you know. All right, you've listened to me ramble enough. I'm going to now show you the receipts, the breakdowns, and all that great stuff. So, oh, the 2 for 20 ends, I believe, Sunday. And that's it. So, thanks so much for listening and watching, and stay tuned for the receipts. I'll see you in one second, I promise. Thanks. Okay, so now I'm back with pricing and all that great stuff. So my store was able to pretty much stack everything to the max. I was able to stack the 20% off coupon I had. I was able to stack the 10 off 30. And the spend 15 bucks and get a free item of a $13 value. So I pretty much scored. And this is the first receipt. I went to two stores. The bulk of the transactions are on the other receipt, which I left in the car. Sorry about that. But this is the first one I just had in the bag. And I pretty much did the same cycle both times around. So it's it's the same thing. Um, it's like crazy. It's just the best deal ever. So let's start with the candles and take it from there. I was basically able to get three candles for and a free item, aromatherapy, of course, for $15.20. It's crazy. So here's a candle, lavender vanilla, twisted peppermint, and winter candy apple. So as you can see, um, they're two for 20 right there. So that's make them 10 bucks each. And then I was able to use the 20% off coupon, which made them, or which took it down to $2 because 10% of, or 20% of, Ten dollars is, I believe, eight, right? So yeah, eight. So I took away two dollars, and then like the big shebang of it all was like four dollars and sixty-seven cents. So that's that, and did the same thing with each of the other candles. And see right there, aromatherapy, the eucalyptus. I don't know what that is. Oh, that's the lotion, LT and lotion use my coupon got that for zero so that's free and total discount 59 bucks and I ended up spending fourteen dollars in tax 120 which gave me fifteen dollars and twenty cents so of course use my little gift card they come in so handy that's my total and yeah so that's pretty much what I did. I did the same thing with the um, Wallflower. They're five bucks. So I think you spend, um, you know, five bucks, get six of them, use your coupon, use coupon, and use coupon. So I did the same transactions and pretty much the same thing on each. And that's pretty much how I saved. Amazing deal, right? It's so good. I don't like rubbing it. I'm like, look at my deal. Look at my deal. <laughs> just kidding. So that's pretty much it, guys. I just wanted to show you, in case you're wondering, you're like, my store didn't let me. It's like, well, you know, I, I can't help it. It's just the luck of the draw, I guess, you know? All right, so that's pretty much everything. And yeah, so I'll talk to you guys soon. Thanks. Love you much. Bye.